Hi, and welcome to Mr. Edwards' GCSE PE revision sessions. These videos give you the option to pause, freeze, and rewind the lessons at your own pace. If we're going to revise the functions of the skeletal system, what better way to do it than with a practical element? Obviously, we can't dissect a real human, but the next closest thing we can do is look at chickens, who share the same structure within the arm, more or less, as humans do. So if we're looking at the function of the skeleton, we've got support, joints, muscle attachment, blood production, and protection. These are all things that you can easily look at when we dissect the chicken wings. If you think about it as the chicken wing as the upper arm, the forearm, the hand, and a little thumb. Obviously the hand section isn't really as related to a human as it could be. However, when you start cutting away the skin, the forearm looks exactly the same as a human's, and the upper arm will look exactly the same as a human's. As you can see here, as we start to strip away, the bones and muscles look very similar to the human anatomy. There's almost a bicep, a tricep, obviously exactly the same as a human arm. Here we can see a tendon. Yeah. I'll just cut it, snap it. Just break it. No, it's there, you see it. Here we can see a tendon. Yeah. Attaching muscle to muscle. I think it's going to the bone, look. Oh, it's muscle to... It's the muscle to muscle, it's here. It's there. That's muscle to bone. And that... There's another tendon as well. As you can see, they share the same tendons and ligaments as the human arm. There's a nice one, mate. Look at the size of that. You see here it's connecting muscle to muscle. There's your ligament. Yeah? Ligaments are softer than the... Um, the tendons are like the valves in the heart. They're about the same texture and material as that. Yeah, and it's going to contract more, I guess. Tendons don't want to contract or move. They don't want to be elastic, do they? Otherwise, your muscle will be hanging off your bone. This needs to be flexible so it can contract. When we start digging away, we have the biceps, triceps, forearm muscles, tendons, ligaments, all exactly the same as the human anatomy. If we strip this away again, we have the bones. We have the radius, the ulna, the humerus. You can see the tendons more clearly now. Obviously, like I said, the hand is the section that's slightly different. Your task is to make a presentation or a video trying to include the following things. The structure, the functions, the bones, the ligaments, tendons, movements possible, types of bones, and muscles. Try and include the joints. Obviously with the dissection we're going to do, you can only look at either ball and socket where the humerus meets the clavicle and the shoulder, or you can look at the hinge where the elbow, where the radius, ulna, and humerus meet. Try and be creative. Thank you for listening to Mr. Edwards' GCSE PE revision videos. If you have any questions, feel free to email me on damianedwards at kingselbarsha.com. Cheers. Bye.